Hi again, everyone. This is going to be kind of a collective haul video. Um, lots of just random stuff that I've picked up over the past few weeks. So I'm going to start with the hair stuff. And the first thing I have is the Bedhead um, Hardhead hairspray and um, my my best friend is my hairstylist and I just got my hair done the other day and she was using this stuff and really likes it and I picked some up and I like it too okay the next stuff I don't have a review on I picked it up because it was on sale and it's all GHD items this one is GHD reflection spray this one is the polishing serum they were all on 50% off at my beauty supply store, so I decided to give these a try. The other thing is Rescue Drops, and it comes in a box like this with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven little tiny bottles, if you can see that. And I used this for the first time a couple of days ago. I don't know if it made any difference to my hair. I guess maybe I'll wait and try it a couple more times before I say yay or nay. But they come in little tiny bottles like this. Now, I don't know if you can see in there, but I only used maybe a third of what's in this bottle. I, I figured I'm not gonna use it all just because it comes in single doses like this if, if I don't need to. So I would probably be able to get two more uses of that. The other set looks the same. And this is called Indulgent Treatment Weekly Conditioning Mask and they come in little tubes. It's kind of like the conditioner that you get after you color your hair. Little tubes with twist off tops. So I did the same thing with this one. I probably used about half of it and I just put saran wrap around it and put it back in here so I'll save it for next time. Same thing again, I used this the same night that I used the other stuff. I put this on, put some heat on my hair and then I put these um, leave-in drops on. So verdict's still out on that stuff. So that's everything hair. Um, I just found out about soap and glory things and I, I think I've been missed the boat on this because everybody seems to know about this stuff and I didn't know it existed and when I found out about it I realized that we have it in Shoppers Drug Marts in Canada so it's kind of has a cult following and it's some really nice products. The first one I got is the Clean On Me uh, body wash, which are, ooh, it's still wet <laughs> from the shower. Uh, I really like this. It's It doesn't seem to lather at all. It's just really nice and moisturizing. Um, the next thing is this Righteous Butter. It's really nice. I like it. I wouldn't say, I've used quite a bit of it already. I don't know if you can see that. But uh, I wouldn't say this is any better than um, Sephora body butter type of thing, similar. So I would have to maybe price this out and price that out and see which one, they're, they're comparable. All of this Soap and Glory um, stuff has a kind of a similar scent and I don't know how to describe it. It's really difficult to describe it. It all kind of smells the same. I think my favorite product that I got is the Flake Away and it's just an exfoliating um, scrub type of thing. And it leaves my skin feeling kind of the same way as this Lush soap does. I, I can't remember for the life of me what this is called. It's something to do with, I don't know, it's the one with the grains in it. But it's a scrub that also leaves your body kind of uh, really moisturized and almost water repellent, if you, if you know the type of feel. I mean, if you put water on your skin, it just kind of, you know, fades away. Um, okay, that's enough of that. I got also got this glow lotion, which I have on right here right now, and it's very very subtle. It's doesn't. It's just kind of a sheen, no shimmer, no glitter. So I like that too. I picked up three of these um, Maybelline Eye Studio things. And I heard about these from the Barbie with Muscle. And if you haven't already checked out her channel, please go over and check her out. Subscribe and, uh, hi Miranda. Um, she's just started on YouTube and uh, she has just a wealth of knowledge about all kinds of things. So please stop by her channel and subscribe and say hello. Say hi for me too. 
Okay, so I'll swatch a couple of these colors for you. They're really pigmented. See that there? Um, just really, really pigmented shadows. And there's one, another one. Um, I think they come in about five different colors. I got these three and it looked like they were selling out pretty fast. So if you can still get these, I think I paid about $11 for these Canadian. And they're just really, really nice for, for a drugstore shadows. These ones are um, from this brown one. That one there. So, oh, I don't think I showed you all the colors that I got. Okay, so I got this one here, which is... Um, Spirited Seas. This one here is Irresistibly Ivy. And this one is Give Me Gold. So that's those. Another couple of items, drugstore items that I got that look really promising are these. I took them out of the packages. It's these CoverGirl Smoky Shadow Blast. That's the packaging it's in. And I got two of them. And what they are, it's like um, kind of a cream shadow on one side. You probably won't be able to see that very well. This one's just a little bit of shimmer. And then on the other side, it's kind of like a cream liner. But the, line, the liner parts are what I'm interested in. They're really nice and um, they have a lot of shine in them. So this one here is called Bronze Fire. And the other one I got is Citrus Flare, which has a green on one side. And I'll try to swatch it for you. You can see that. And then this is the other side is the reason that I bought it though. It is a really orange color. So I'm gonna try using that as a liner and see how it how it goes. Okay, uh, one more drugstore item is this Physician's Formula uh, Shimmer Strip, and this is Pop. And they have these for different eye colors. They didn't have the brown eyes one, so I got the one for hazel eyes. These are not nearly as pigmented as the Maybelline ones that I showed you, but they're still, they're still nice colors. I'll put some on my fingers there and you can see Okay, so that's that. Um, I better move quickly here. The other thing I got was this Gosh uh, Giant Sun Powder, and it's just a really nice, it's really soft, and it's just, um, it's not really a bronzer, it's just kind of a shimmer powder, but not too much shimmer, so you can put it all over your face. The next thing is the Multicolor Blush in Bronze Pie, and this is Gosh as well. And this is, I mean, it's kind of deceiving, but it comes off really, really dark. And I haven't tried that one yet, so I don't have anything to say about it. Um, okay, just quickly a couple more items. And I saw these on a video by Jean-Francois CD, and he is absolutely phenomenal. So if you haven't checked out his channel, I would suggest you stop by. I'll put a link in the sidebar both to Marinda the Barbie with Muscle and uh, Jean-Francois CD. So we can check their channels out. But he was using this uh, Lee Swatche uh, pigment. And I'll put some on my finger. It's kind of a white color. This is called um, Foley Blanche. And then I got another one, which I think is opal. Let me see. Yes, opal. So that's the blanche on the ring finger and that's the opal on the middle finger there. So really like those. Um, I do have some other things, but I'm running out of time. So I guess I'll put those in the next video. Okay, everybody, thanks for watching. See you next time, bye.